Welcome to Vlogmas week two. So today I had lots of plans. I overslept. So that hasn't happened yet. Also, I'm still in my onesie. And I'm having a cup of tea and we surprised. Um, but I thought I would open this vlog with my advent calendar. So, day five. As if it's the 5th of December already and we still don't have a Christmas tree. <gasps> it's a bath fizzer. I could have done with this last night. Why did they put them in such tiny little boxes? I've nearly got it. No. Why is it so difficult? Okay, let's have a look. Red berry and cedar bath visit, is that? I'm pretty sure one of these was that. Yes, the little body wash. Festive notes of pine needles, cedar wood, red berries and candied sugar. I like that it's a little bath visit. a little square one. In other news, we won the World Cup game last night against Senegal, 3 you now. Um, so that's fabulous. No one. Are you allowed to talk? Yeah? Have you shaved your face? Yes, I know. You've done a really bad job. I know. You've missed know. this bit up here. <laughs> hi, Stanley. Do you want to say hi? Come here, chunk. How you saying hello? Happy Vlogmas, Tan Tan! Ready to say it as well. <laughs> do we go do some editing? Look at my editing buddies right now. This little one, this little one, and this little one. <laughs> I think they all approve of my new blanket. Good morning. I'm late for work. It's cold. It's sunny. But yeah, I'm late. So I'm going to have to rush. So I'll check in later. Tuesday. So I'm just leaving work and you can't really see it properly. But look at the moon. I'm pretty sure it's like almost full. Or it could be completely full. I wish you could like... I don't think my phone will ever pick up the moon. Wow, look at that. Crazy! Day six. My riddles are getting better. Mm -hmm. I have hands but cannot clap. That's a clock. That was quick. Now then, which clock? Oh, which clock? <laughs> this clock. Oh, this film. This feels a bit interesting. Well, what do you think it is? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Peaky Blinders calendar. Isn't that exciting? It is, if I knew how to open it. From this bit. Ah. I thought it was quite cute. Thank you very much. All right. Got mine to do. <coughs> Been very busy away tidying my room, even though I was meant to do it days ago. Okay, six. For five more minutes, we're six. Whoa, whoa, we're six. I'm making a right mess. Oh, it's a bigger body wash. I don't, oh, yeah, it's, is it bigger than that one? It is, oh, it's got a little doggy on it. London People London Tea Body Wash. A refreshing blend of breakfast tea notes. Served with zesty bergamot, jasmine, amber, musk, and precious woods. Mm. Breakfast tea's my favourite. My absolute <laughs> bloody favourite. Let's have a sniff, shall we? Oh my god, it does. It smells like tea. Yay! That's day six, bloody done, isn't it? Oh, look at that spot on my head. It's hardly noticeable. Are you joking? Look at it in my camera. Oh, you can see it in the camera. Bob. Yeah. Disgusting. Let's get some of these. We're in Palmer right now. 
we've been in uh, B&M and we've got some Christmas pezzies and stuff. Mum's looking for Christmas cards, which I don't particularly think you're going to find in here. I may or may not have purchased a new Christmas mug. Oh look, a foot pack with gonks on it. Them foot packs kind of freak me out though. Yeah. Dinosaurs! I don't know why I'm still filming, but we're looking for things for the dogs. Oh, we bought um, Teddy his Christmas present as well. I'm not sure, Mum. That's a different flavour. Probably just this flavour. Getting so excited about cleansing wipes. She is. Look how excited she's got about those wipes. I didn't mean to do that. You've broken it. I don't know how to fix it. <laughs> this is the UK's freshest streaming service. It didn't even bloody work. Fresh with it? thousands it's of shows that. and films. The fresh in front Shut of up. films as well this time. <laughs> right. What we're trying to show you is that Stanley's being weird with this balloon. What have you got, 10 10? Hello. I'm not sure why I look quite greasy today. But the last clip you listened was Stanley playing with his balloon. He's obsessed, honestly. I had to sneak into the cupboard so my dad wouldn't see, so sorry dad. It's a little gonk. How cute is this? This is from B and M. It was £3.50. And I'm obsessed. Oh, and I got this really cool coffee thing. Because I'm gonna try and start drinking more coffee at home. But obviously it's supposed to be gifted. But I don't see the point in gifting like a Christmas stencil when Christmas will be over by the time you open it. You know what I mean? So it's a coffee topper collection. So it's got cinnamon powder, vanilla sugar. I'm very excited about that. Chocolate sprinkles and cocoa powder. And it was three pounds and then it comes with a little bauble stencil. So I think I might try that out tomorrow. It's very cute. We also got some triple cheese pizza Doritos and some loaded pepperoni pizza Doritos. I can't eat the pepperoni ones because I actually have meat in them. But I'm intrigued. I'm very intrigued. 
That was loud. Also, I had a jacket potato with beans and cheese for my tea. So yummy. But I had plant-based cheese and it was actually really nice. I've got some of the snowman and the snow dog marshmallows. They sell these every year in B&M. They're so good and it's like the only thing I break my vegetarianism for because these marshmallows are something else. And it's not like I'm eating a chunk of meat. Like it doesn't make me poorly. Pork liver pate with duck and orange. Absolutely not. Oh, some pigs in blankets gravy, which I can eat. I'm so excited about that. Like, I don't think you guys understand how much I miss pigs in blankets. It's so sad. I'm currently looking for a new Reginald for Thomas because Reginald got destroyed. Also, this woman talking in the background. Love her. Yeah, Thomas had this mouse called Reginald. And it was like his favourite thing ever. Like, my cat... Stay. My cat never plays with toys. And he was like obsessed with this little mouse. This flat mouse. And I don't know where he came from. But he did get destroyed by the little Freya. So I'm trying to find him a new one. I need to go make my cup of tea and then i'm gonna get back to cleaning my room it's currently what 11 yeah it's 11 p.m i'm at work again at 12 tomorrow today really wasn't that bad at work it was a bunch of old people that came in to i don't know have their last christmas dinner together as a group i guess and it was really sweet there was a policeman who stood up at the end to do a speech Speech, everybody, I'm gonna make a speech. Speech! I'm gonna make a speech, everybody. Yeah, he stood up and made a speech and he was one of the detectives on the Yorkshire Ripper case, which I just thought was awesome. I'm really getting back into true crime at the minute. Like I bought myself a Jeffrey Dahmer book the other day. Finally finished the series, really enjoyed it. As I do with literally everything that Ryan Murphy does. And then I watched the conversations with a killer, like, is it that one? Like the tapes. And I really enjoyed that as well. And I would like to know if you have any recommendations. Like documentaries and true crime stuff that I should watch because I do love me a good true crime show. I've seen a handful of the ones that are on Netflix. So I've seen The Ripper. Again, interesting because it happened literally around where I lived, which is crazy. I say live, live. And also, there was a guy who came into our school once who was the son of the first victim. And also, my dad was engaged to his niece. Crazy. I've watched the Ripper one. I've watched the Night Stalker one. Is that what it's called? Night Stalker. The one about Ramirez. I've watched Ted Bundy one. Ted Bundy just doesn't interest me that much. I'm about to watch the John Wayne Gacy one, but he scares the living daylights out of me, like no joke. Also, being and Wick Cleaner, this is not a left handed one. Anyway, I'm going to go for my bro. Go for a wee. I'm desperate for a wee. <laughs> and probably finish tidying my room. So I'll check back in soon. If not, I'll see you tomorrow. Look how pretty the front of the house looks. Also, you can see my mum at work. And the ground is so crunchy. It's so cold. To do day seven. I am. Extra super ready. Have you got your riddle brain on? No. Bit dark in here, isn't it? But I'm eating a breadstick. So day seven. I greet every guest, but never say a word. Door. No. Ring doorbell. But that does say a word. That does say a word. <laughs> to be fair, you can't see one right now. Can't see one. Because we don't have it right now. Oh. A door. A what? A doormat. Is that what sorry. you just said? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. It's all right. <coughs> I don't think I'd have ever got it. I was trying to think you were going to be right. A doormat. <laughs> We don't actually have one. Well, we do. Outside. <laughs> We're not outside. It's cold. Okay. Come on. Let's 
Sorry, maybe this will help with the cold. Oh my god. <laughs> Are they not the coolest things ever? Oh my god. Am I allowed to put these on? Yeah, you can do whatever you want with the presents you've got. It's an advent calendar. It's like saying, oh my god, you can open the door but you can't eat the chocolate. Do you like them? Yes. Yeah, I think you should wear them like that. As mittens. Oh, look, and they'll match your jumper. Wow. Hello, everyone. I love how I'm still wearing my work thing, even though I left work like six hours ago. <laughs> I would sit here. Because I haven't opened my advent calendar today. So, Annie came over, she cut my mum's hair. We ate, and then we went for a drive. And the um, exit we would normally take was closed off wasn't signpost anyway so we ended up driving to a further away starbucks because we were like we want a coffee i ordered mine i tried the caramel waffle latte because i haven't tried it before very good and then they just were like when we pulled up to the drive through they were like oh we're having an issue with the tills will you just come around to the next window and then they just never charged me for my coffee so i'm presuming they meant to do that because he was like i like went to pay for it and he was like oh no no it's fine go and i was like okay so that was that anyway number seven the little one up here i feel like it's going to be another one of those little body washes which i love oh cute it's if i can get it out it's a cuticle cream which is very cool um it's good safe um, this is a little cuticle cream. It's a citrus and sandalwood cuticle cream. Cooling notes of cucumber and green limes balanced with sandalwood and musk. I want to smell it. <laughs> oh, it smells lovely. Very refreshing. That's so cute. I thought they were all going to be like body lotion, hand cream, body wash sort of thing. Cuticle cream. That's very cute. I like cute. <laughs> Get it? I like that. But yeah, what else do I need to do? I do need to start the Christmas quiz as I only have like two weeks to do it and I'd like it to be ready before then. <laughs> That'll be exciting, so I need to do some research for that. We also need a Christmas tree because <laughs> it's a week into December and we still don't have a Christmas tree, which is just abysmal in my eyes. I think I might read for a bit tonight too because I have been reading the same Stephen King book since August and I've read stuff like in between it because I just couldn't get into it and now I'm over halfway through it and I just need to know like I have to know so I can move on to a different like a Christmas book because I have a few Christmas books that I wanted to read and it's just not happening is it but I don't want to be reading seven million things at the same once same once at the same time I'm currently reading Needful Things by Stephen King which actually is really good, but it's really baffling my brain at the minute. Like, it's taken me so long to get through because there's so much to it. I feel like that's the case with a lot of Stephen King stuff, but... Anyway, and I'm also reading Solitaire by Alice Ellisman, which I don't think will take me long to get through at all when I get into it, but I've read, like, the first chapter of that. And I really like it because I love the character of Tori Spring anyway, if any of you are the Heartstopper fans. Okay, you'll know what I'm talking about. The lights said, shut up, Kerry. <laughs> Me and Dad have come to get a Christmas tree. Big deal. Christmas trees in a pot. Living alive, yeah, it is. Yep. Awesome. Thank you. Not these. It's a old ones again, minimum needle drop. Butt grown. Like that so that. Then you've got the smaller one again. Near Northman. Butt grown. That's that's not big thing, is it? No, it's not. It's quite nice, actually, that one. Pot grow. Mm. I like that one. You're on the table, you see. I feel like that one's a bit too sparse at the top. Yeah. Not quite as sparse as that one. But, um, we've gone for a small one. Let's put it on the table. Mr. Tree. Oh, yeah. That's it. You ain't boss, you ain't you got it. 
Sound that. Perfect. What is this? Minion milkers. Yes. Yeah. What's going on? Bottom. Bottom. Bottom crack. It's a baby. You're so, so cute. Oh. Really? Oh, she's like a little teddy bear. Aren't you the cutest thing ever? That's what she wants, a back scratch. Oh, he scratched her back. Oh, is that nice? <laughs> Thank, Thank you, man. You. Look how happy that dog is. <coughs> oh my God, stop. Actually, stop. Cheese. We've made our first purchase. <coughs> We've got some chocolate rum. I'm not being funny, it's the tastiest thing I've tasted in my life. It's a bit good, isn't it? Yeah, just a little bit. Yeah, do, I, do, <laughs> I do look like a gunk. I look so much like oh, I just came poking in the corner. So we've got a bottle of that for Christmas. Yeah. Oh, well, they look cosy. That looks really cosy. <laughs> do you want to have a feel? I'm the wife. Oh, wow. Charge it. <laughs> Oh, well, that's nice. Tobacco and nectar. That's beautiful. It's so fucking cold. We've got food. I've got uh, hummus and waffle wrap, which I get every time. I come to the street food place. Mum's getting, mum's getting beef steak and chips. Um, look, she's getting a burrito. The man gave me a free falafel. Very lovely. He was like, he put the five into this one and then went, and this one's for you. And I was like, oh, thank you. <laughs> That's insane. That's actually insane. <laughs> I love it. Oh my God. That's skill. That's skill. Squish it. Excited. <laughs> I've tapped out, but these guys are still going. <laughs> That's so impressive. No. Creepy. Creepy people. Creepy people. I've got a hot chocolate with a shot of whiskey. Woohoo! They've got mold wine. Love that. What have you got? I got the most wine. 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 It's bloody cold. <laughs> it's like waiting for the bastard car to charge. <clears throat> Go away. <laughs> hey legends, we're back from the Christmas market. It was very fun, but extremely cold. It's like minus four here right now, which is ridiculous. But we managed to get a couple of hours there unfortunately i'm working like most days so we haven't had time to like i don't have a full day off where someone else has a full day off my outfit was cute though i had this jumper on which i think it's from primark a long time ago and it now has holes in the sleeves to keep my hands warm and this t-shirt which i think might be from bep and co i think it's from poundland which is great and i had my boohoo man jeans on that i wore to comic con but Currently I'm wearing Arkham Asylum pants because they've gone through all and I've still got my converse on. I've still got my converse on because it was cold outside and I did not want to deal with the cold. Also Christmas present I wanted to buy has just come back in stock so I'm going to get that because I got paid today. I think that's about all. I haven't done my advent calendar today actually. I'll go downstairs and do that. I haven't done mum's today either. But we'll just do two days tomorrow because we just have not had time. Also my panda eyes right now. So I forgot to take my makeup off last night and then today I've just put eyeliner on <laughs> instead of putting a full face on because it's always my fallback and I ended up looking like such a little emo kid. Oh we have a Christmas tree. We get the Christmas tree, his name is Desmond. Let's open day eight. Oh it's big. Oh, it's a big hand cream. I always think when they put hand creams in giant shoes, they never can be used. Red berry and cedar. I do really like this scent that they keep putting in. These red berry and cedar ones smell so Christmassy. They smell just like a tree. I'm not sure what scents run through it. So, so far we've had 
the citrus and sandalwood, the red berry and cedar, and the whatever this range is. Power to the peaceful. So maybe there's another range. Maybe they're just going to add to that range of all the phases. I'm not sure. Who knows? I mean, if this doesn't scream winter, I don't know what does. Hey. We've got little Tedster until Tuesday, but his daddy just left, so he's a bit sad. He'll get over it though. I'm trying not to pamper to him, but he's just come and parked his bum here, so. He lied to you as well, didn't he? And he said he'd be back soon. He's a big fat liar. Look at you! We've just picked him up from the groomers. <laughs> Look at that leg. <laughs> he looks so funny. Day eight, I go up and down but I never move. That's got to be the stairs. Are you going to do both riddles and then open them both? Or? If you want me to. No, it's up to you. I'll just do one at once then. It's a tangle teaser with a mert on it. It's an airbrush. Is it? A, oh, I thought this is just a. Oh, it's a paddle hairbrush. brush. A paddle hair brush. And a mirror. A mirror. Oh, is that what that is? Yeah. Thank you very much. Hey. What did you say? I said I'm excited because I get to do two today. <laughs> we missed yesterday's because we had to go straight out. Day number nine. Day nine. I'm made of water, but will die if you put me in water. Made of water. I will die if you put me in water. Confused with that one. I don't actually know. Right? I'm proper confused. Can I have a clue? Dad, come here. Mum's stuck on her riddle. I've got it says, I'm made of water, but will die if you put me in water. <laughs> What's made of water? Oh. I don't know. I can only think of water or cucumber, and that's all I can think of. Steam. <laughs> right. Or? <laughs> you have steam, you have water, and then you have... Gas. No. The frozen part of water. Ice. <laughs> okay. Where would you go to get ice? In the freezer. To be fair, it's a bit more specific than that. The ice machine. Ice machine. I thought you might have known what that was, because... I had an inkling, I thought you said yesterday, but... Yeah. Cute. It matches you your scarf as well. It does match my scarf. I'm not going to put it on now because I've already got head hair and I need to sort head hair before I go out. Hat oh, hair. shut up. You should have head hair. Hat hair. Baldy. Right, thank you very much. That will come in very, very handy. Right. How do you feel about it? Oh, okay. I'm back in my calendar opening spot with Mandy's ass in the background. Number nine. Oh, it says soap. Cassis and rose. Give it a half a cup of tea. Thank you. Not finished the video. No. Nope. and frankincense. Frangipani's are flowers, aren't they? Yeah. Cassis and rose. Keep kind, cassis and rose scented soap. Like her berries, juicy and aromatic. Cassis? Yeah, Frangipan's a person. There's someone with the name Frangipan, but I don't know who. Oh! Dancer, actress. Not Claudia, is it? Um, it's not Frangipani, isn't it? Fucking hell, what's her name? Gabrielle Frangipani? She's she's a figure skater. I know Halsey's na last name is Frangipani, but that's really going to stress me out, that is. That's nice. That's a new scent. I haven't had this scent before. This is what I look like. Claudia Frangipani. Claudia Frangipani, yeah. Does she exist? Yeah. Who is it? Gymnast. Why would I know her name? And she played on Strictly Come Dancing. Ah, she was on Strictly. Yeah, I can hear it in his voice now. <laughs> of him saying it. Dancing the cha cha. Oh, I know who she is. I know who she is as well. Victoria Frangipani. Frangipani. That's how they said her name on Strictly. You did. Bit aggressive for no reason. Did I have a name before I was born? 
or did you name me after I was born? What? I always think it's a bit weird, like, when you name your kids after they're born, because, like, they just don't have a name, then. You just have an idea, look, Lexi and Andrew didn't know I was going to be a boy or a girl. Did you know I was going to be a girl? Yeah. thought Andrew was a girl, didn't you? I mean... Should be. <laughs> and you could say the same for Lexi, to be honest. <laughs> Why Kerry Joanne, though? Any particular reason? No. And why that spelling? Did you just picture it that way? Or did you think about spelling it the other way? I wanted to look different. I mean, I've been knocked out on penalty. No way! I didn't see that coming. Who were they against? Croatia. Wow, that's a surprise. Do we play France then tomorrow? Yeah. Will we have a nice snuggle? Thank you. She's so nice. Been a long day being pampered and tit. First vlog clip of the day. We have a new rug. I'm very excited about what it is, President. <laughs> day 10. Yeah. Day 10. You can turn me up high, keep warm or on low, but no matter the setting, the cooking will be slow. Well, that's a slow cooker. Correct. Do you have any idea what it might be? Because you brought it up to me when it came. It's a box. Yeah. Make sure you open it so that it's like the right way up. Oh my God, have you adopted me an elephant? Yeah. <laughs> about it and stuff. Do you have a name or not? I'm not sure. There's nothing that doesn't say a name. I think you can pick one maybe. <laughs> That's the ones you're protecting. Strong, smart, but so vulnerable. Your adoption is helping us monitor and protect herds like this one in the Maasai Mara National Reserve in Kenya. Oh wow, so I, I have adopted. You've adopted an elephant, but basically the money goes to protecting the yeah. different herds. Oh, it's so cool. <laughs> Thank you so much. That's all right. Okay, please ignore the state of me. I'm looking fabulous. I haven't brushed my hair today. <laughs> We're gonna open number 10. Won't be as exciting as mom's, but... Oh, I ripped it. <laughs> Rip the advent calendar. I've been doing pretty well at that, apart from the first one. It's a lip balm! Get in! <laughs> I'm still going to take this to work with me today. Eggnog lip balm? Are you joking? Oh my god, that smells so good. Right, that's a bit of a rip off, isn't it? I squeeze like this much and there's none coming out. Like half full. What is that? Oh, it's really thick. It feels like a lip gloss. Very cute. Mmm. Smells great. Do you like sitting there? He's <laughs> holding my hand. He's put himself here. Do you love your grandma? Oh, that's nice, isn't it? That's nice. Thank you, Teddy. He's so kind, isn't he? Yes. Give him lots of loves, aren't you, Teddy? He's so kind. Lots of loves. Oh, thank you. Oh. Oh, we're being silly now. Is that what's happening? <laughs> Are you pretty? <laughs> Hi. I just got home from work. <laughs> For context, I don't know whether I've said this, but we're looking after my brother's dog for a couple of days while he's in London. And I just got back from work. It's like half one. I'm gonna make a cup of tea. I feel socially exhausted. Like, I don't ever wanna see another pint of beer ever again. And I'm in work tomorrow, so. <laughs> Not gonna happen. I need to make some food. I think I'm gonna have rice. 
I'm like obsessed with like packet rice with cheese and ketchup. So. I don't know if I've mentioned that either. But I need to edit tomorrow too. But I should be finished work by like nine because we close early on a Sunday. So all is good, all is good. Back to tea making. My mum's in love with her gift today which I'm happy about. I knew she'd be really happy with this one. Two big fat sugars in there, because I deserved it. But also, <laughs> today at work, this is how cold it was. So the glass washer is made of metal, and I had my hands pushed up against the glass washer as it was washing glasses, so that it would make them come back to life because my hands had gone numb. There's literally, it sounds like really bad, but it's only because when you're stood behind the bar, there's a huge draft that comes in from the cellar, and all of the, our pipes are freezing up at the minute as well, which is extremely stressful for the ice machine. I felt the warmth. Can I pick you up? Is that okay? I have to tell him to park him up, even though he loves being out. But here he is, the boy himself. So, I shall see you all tomorrow. Ooh. Oh, it'll be the last day of the week tomorrow. Fun times. Do you know what I just realised? We haven't done your advent calendar. Mm. Oh, we've got a baby gate at the bottom of the stairs. Also, look at all these pictures. Pet family. We've got a baby gate so that Freya can't get upstairs. Day 11. Day 11. Adding bubbles to me is fun. You usually get in me at night when your day is done. That's the bath. Tis the bath. <coughs> Isn't it, Midge? Isn't it? It's the bath. Can it open in the bathroom? Well, it doesn't really matter, but huh? you can do. Comfy socks. Remember when we were in TK Maxx and you tried you to buy some? Yeah. <laughs> and I was like, put them back! <laughs> the colour scheme. I know. The colour scheme. There is a running the beige colour scheme. Hey. I am sat in bed currently editing. It's. Well, I haven't checked the time in ages. 10 to 2. <laughs> I did not know that. Yeah, I'm editing and I've edited 15 minutes of it so that there's like 15 minutes of footage I had. And I still have about an hour of footage left to edit. So I've got it down from two hours to this so far. Ooh. Time to me goes so fast when I'm editing. I'm sat here with my little spider, which I love. I look rough as hell because I need to shower and my hair is going crazy. But I do have this candle. I do have this candle burning and when I tell you it is one of the yummiest candles I've ever sniffed that was a really bad angle and <laughs> quite clearly tired <laughs> the fucking state of me right now it's so good it's pumpkin and bourbon from the brand M and M of WG I think it's from TK Maxx so there you go. I honestly don't remember filming this much footage. Like, this is crazy. What on earth? Oh, I just remembered I haven't done my advent calendar today. I did my mum's, but I never did mine. Let's go and do that. Pull that out before I leave the room. Oh, wow. There's a lot of smoke. There's a lot of smoke. <laughs> I got distracted making food. Yes, I'm making rice at like 3 a.m. But, what day is it today? The 11th? 
I was like, did I do it today already? I did it. Let's do this. I can't believe we're halfway through, basically. Nearly. Tomorrow we'll be halfway through. It's another body wash. This calendar is so cute. This is the Power to the Peaceful Body Wash. So it matches the other two I have. By bringing together notes from all four elements in perfect harmony, we've created a tranquil and rounded scent to appeal to all. A blend of 10 essential oils from earth, fire, air, and water to balance and restore celestial harmony. I love that. That's so sweet. An FYI, Devil Santa's back. My mum, <clears throat> hello. My mum has been putting up some little bits and pieces of Christmas decorations while I was at work today because obviously it's literally the 11th today and we didn't have any up apart from the outside ones but I thought I would end the vlog here it's a little bit dark in here but that's all right <laughs> I thought I would end the vlog here because it is Sunday night and it will roll over to next week so if you enjoyed this video even though it was long it was rambly not that festive, but more festive than last week's. Um, please do give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below and all that stuff. And donate to the charities if you can. I've left a bunch of links in the description. And if you can't, please do share the links with your friends on your social media because it definitely does help. And I will see you all next week. Good night.